He's an orphan. What do you want? Want to talk to Blue Boy Lugos. <laughs> Hear that? He wants to talk to Lugos. What else, Vagrant? Care to plow Freya? Works for me if you can arrange it. I can arrange a knife between your ribs as you sink to the bottom of the bay. Now bugger off! Don't make me hurt you. Got enough trouble as it is. Think you scare me? Scare your old son of Odmore? Known elseways as the Wolverine? Hey! What's all the hollering? Some stranger wants on the longship. Says he's got business, but, uh... Let him pass. If he turns a nuisance, we'll toss him overboard. See you later, Jarl, son of the Wolverine, or whatever it was. Never jest about my da. Never! Me wife's mom marching at their head. Know the last time I had a Continental on my ship? No. When I hauled prisoners from Velen to the slave market in Nazaire. Now, tell me why you're here. Your father felt you could use a witcher's help, and I owe him a favor, so... Told him not to meddle. Told him I'd manage fine on my own. Maybe that's not entirely true. Cave of Dreams. Supposed to be a dangerous place. Mortally so, but that's my reason for going there. Fine, so be it, I take you. Old man's like to throw a fit elsewise. Or he's about to go. You ready? We can go. Is it far? Nah, stone's throw. Let's gather the lads and go in. We'll know soon if there's truth to the legends. Garlic, these are the best warriors in me crew. They'll come with us. You know Jarl, called the Wolverine? Good day. And this here is Oov Jabberjaw. Why is Oov so quiet? Because he got no tongue. What happened? He lick a frozen blade? No. He tore it out because he cursed King Bran while drunk. Lost his power to speak, but kept his honor. Interesting customs you got here. Before we head off, will you tell me about this cave? You could at least tell me what we might have to fight. Only you can know that. Elders say in the Cave of Dreams you face your greatest fears. Face what makes you wake up at night, screaming. Something that's already been, will be, or just might be. I do wonder what a monster slayer fears. But we've talked enough, lads. Swords in hand. Let's go! Should be. Now's when we eat the herbs. Why would we do that? To go on. To where the nightmares are. So says the legend. And so we will do. Fine. Give him here. Take it. Oof. Yarl, eat up. To the last grain. I don't feel no different. How about you, Oof? <laughs> You're asking a mute his opinion. You're feeling it, mate. Come on, let's go. Time to face our fears. for a razor back. That's a blue. A blue? But that short of snout. Carbs are robbed you, your senses.
That's not possible. I see you're weary from the battle. Sit with me, so Have some mead. Pray tell me your adventures. Thank you, my king. We... I shan't drink with you, old man. And I shan't call you king. Get off that throne while you've still strength in your decrepit bones. Oof. You can talk. Uh, I, I, I... I didn't... But, but I... <gasps> you insult me once more, old Jabberjaw. The first time I left you to punish yourself and retain your honor, but now... Now you'll die like a troll and eels will eat your remains. Clear my conscience. Let's go. My dream. I don't fear nothing.
was three years old. I've shown a hundred times since then that I... You pissed yourself before the whole village, the Jarl's son. Ah, the shame should have punished you. You're a vision, a spectre. A vision of your dog, who you fear, because you know you don't live up to him. You know you disappoint him. I'm a better warrior than he ever was. Prove it, you little shite. Who's the better warrior now? Who? Who goes leaving? There's only a vision true, but it's not proper. Get up, Garrett. You've paid your debt. You're a free man. Gonna tell your father what you faced in the Cave of Dreams? Of course I will. I've no fear of him, right? It was an honor to fight at your side. Farewell, Garrett. Greetings again. See, I had no intention of cheating you. Your coin. You're lucky. I'm not exactly known for being forgiving. Still, take my advice. Find a new profession. I've not seen you here before. What do they call you? Geralt of Rivia. I'm Yuta Undimon. No man's been found who could best me in combat. Will you fight me? You? I've defeated Pharaoh's most famous warriors. Men so worthy of respect I don't dare mention their names. And who is Geralt of Rivia? Someone you haven't defeated. Maybe you're not worthy of my time? You performed any great feats? Because I don't believe I've heard. What kind of feats you have in mind? Hmm. I'll fight you, if you defeat Gundar. Couldn't best me, but he's a brave man and a worthy opponent. Good. I'll give it a shot. See you soon. I truly wonder if you will. Farewell. Looking for more challengers? Welcome to our tournament, Witcher. 
Einer awaits an opponent. Do you wish to face him? Let's not keep Einer waiting. May it be a clean and beautiful fight. Beautiful fight. Congratulations on your victory. You've more fights ahead of you. First you must defeat Grimm from Helmstein and Art Skellig, and Valgard from near Kertrolda. You Gundar? I? I want to fight you. Why me exactly? Asking out of curiosity, given you're a foreigner. All right. Yuda said she'd fight me if I defeated you. Yuda said that? Means that if I win, she'll give me another chance. Well, come on, let's do this. You step outside the ring, you lose. Got it? Maybe troll to me brothers. Mikael and Ulf sailed to Hindersfjall to fetch Agda, weddings in but a few days, but they've yet to return. A storm broke while they were gone. I fear it might have blown them onto the rocks at Pharaoh. Many have lost their lives there. I'll sail out to find them, I would, but I've got to make sure the wedding's proper prepared. They say it's not fitting for a Skelliger to ask for aid, but I've no choice. Will you help me? Will you seek out my kin? Fine. I'll look around for them. You've come in greetings, White One. I defeated Gundar. Hmm. Thought you'd be no match for him. All right. We'll see how you fare against me. Ready when you are. Then let's start. May Freya choose the victor. Surprised you have a hard time finding worthy opponents. In the end, one came along. Where'd you learn all that? At Kaer Morin. Kaer Morin? That's terribly far. But you learned a great deal on the road as well, surely. Would you tell me about it? It'd make for a long story. All right. We need a quiet spot, some good mead, and... What do you say? Gladly. See you at the inn? Too rowdy. Come to my home in Harvican. I'll be waiting after dusk. See you later then.
Come on. of the sea. I've never begrudged you no gifts. Grant me another victory, so I can make you another offer in the loot. Don't mind me. Fuck, what now? Heard you were in Keratin's band. Fucking say what you want. Come on, spit it out, you arse-licking bastard. I'm looking for Yad Keratin. And just who the hell are you? A friend of a friend. I'm looking for Keratin. Thought maybe we could make some sort of deal. What? Our business robbing some Novigrad pricks the wrong way? Plowing guilds. Come on, what are you waiting for? Kill the fucker! any better? Greetings. I started to think you changed your mind. I'd never miss a chance to spend a pleasant evening with you. I don't know that I'll make for engaging company. In truth, I rarely talk to men. Rarely? Why? Well, I don't like to waste time chatting before fights. And after them, I've none left to talk to. And now that I've finally met someone stronger, seems Freya's played a cruel trick on me. What's Freya got to do with it? I swore to the goddess that only he who bested me in battle would lie with me, take me as his wife, and give me children. Wrong guy beat you, unfortunately. Yes, I know. Witchers aren't husband material, nor can they sire children. But it was you who bested me. And I'm sure many warriors in Skellige are worthier of your attention than I am. One would be enough. Never thought of searching the other isles? Hmm. You could be right. I believe it may be time to leave Pharaoh. Well, good luck, Utah and Dimmon. You're a witcher, right?
blew and bloated. Didn't seem to bother the sirens, though. Must have nabbed her body soon after she drowned. Kira's lamp ought to prove really handy here. Give your sons. Meant to escort our brother's patrol to her wedding, a storm beset us of bastards. All is lost. Agda lies dead. Her dowry drowned. Tis a taint on the clan's honor. Forgive us, O oh Freya, most noble. Stop, Miguel. Freya can't wash our shame away. Only blood can. Let's do it as it must be done. There, beneath the tree. We'll pray, and then end it. Aye, you're right. Be better that way. Footprints. Wonder where they lead. Skelligan Honor chose to die instead of living with the knowledge they'd let down their brother. Got some bad news. Sadly, Agda's dead. So are your brothers. Uh, what? How? What are you saying? A storm destroyed their boat. Agda was killed. Your brothers felt they'd let you down, couldn't live with the shame. They chose death. Found this letter. Might help you come to terms. A letter? That's all that's left of them. Sorry, didn't find anything else. Can we talk? Wouldn't happen to play Gwent, would you? Certainly. I got my first deck. Oh, years ago, back in Sintra. Proceeded to teach the game to half of Skellige. Why do you ask? Looking to play? Yeah, glad to play around. Lovely. My congratulations. You've a good deck, but it could use a bit of supplementation. Here, take this card. Thanks. You've a knack for it. So much so you ought to challenge Crack. I gave him his deck and introduced him to the game. But the pupil has surpassed his master. There's also Gremist, a vile character, but undeniably talented. <laughs> we must have another. That's good stuff. Aye, as the best from Moss Gordon and Spirit from Hail Hell. Good times, Fritz off. <laughs> Good times. Finally, something other than damn potions and transmutations. Guess the ritual's not over yet. Good. I thought I told you to stay outside. 
Will he turns in the inner circle? Circle, Smirkle. Let the boy have some fun. He's earned it. <laughs> Fine. Pour yourself some. Garrett, let the lessons begin. Drink hard and study hard. A likely idea. Yeah, yeah. I call it stimulation. A simulation. First you stimulate, and then <laughs> you assimilate. A shutdown. <laughs> Let's start with ingesting toxins. Best approach, practice makes perfect. Mm -hmm. I've practiced a lot already. Good thing. I'll be learning my secret method. Easier. Look, you take the potion like this, and go. Who said old age is a burden? What do you want now? I taught you all I know. Gwent. Ever play the game? If your question is, would I be interested in playing you? The answer is simple. No. Afraid of losing? I understand. Very well. I drive your deck. Win. And I'll give you my best card. One. I believe you're ready to challenge Madman Lugos. I do wonder if he'll agree to play you for his catacan. Well, what is it? Gwent, know the game? The gulls shed off cliffs? Let's see your duck. It's been a dull day. We'll play for my catacan. Show me what you can do. Dying to gut you. But then, they'd say Lugos had gone even madder. Take my catacan and sort off. Who will I leave my home to a child that dies? Who will continue my line? Mind if I interrupt? Nay. My prayers are in vain anyways. Here you're having trouble with a curse. I... I am. Look. See it lying there. The horse head on the pole. That's... A nithing. Kind of curse. Seen this before. They're nothing to scoff at. Can bring misfortune, even death. Aye. And the name carved upon it is Tialva. My firstborn! Oh, he's feverish. Grows weaker by the day. I fear I'll bury him before the next moon. Tried to lift the curse myself, but... No luck. I can help you. One of two ways. First, I can try to convince whoever put up the nithing to lift the curse themselves. Second, I can deflect the curse back on whoever cast it by writing their name on the shaft. Either way, need to know who's behind this. But I don't trouble no one. Don't know a soul who'd wish it upon me. Mm-hmm. Guess I gotta investigate. A nithing. A powerful curse. Name carved on the shaft. Tialva, son of Lothar. Trails fresh. Hmm. Might want to look around some. Hmm. What is this? Woman's shawl. Distinctive pattern. Distinctive smell. Too many scents. Can't follow my nose any further. Need to ask around about the shawl. A witcher? Where's your road, Wim? You, Odin? I am. 
hear about me, Sonny? Where should I look for your son? East of here. It's the ruins of the fortress. He went there with some rogues from Pharaoh. Met him at the tavern. They filled his head with nonsense about some treasure. I said, Sonny, Pharaoh folk are liars to a man. You shouldn't fraternize with them. But he knew better. How'll I recognize him? All I know is he doesn't listen to his father. Pretty typical for his age. His name's Olve. A cheerful lad. A bit of a lisp. Nothing special about his looks. Except last I saw him he was wearing a yellow tunic. Lovely. None other like it in the village. Got it from me a year back. On his birthday. That ought to do it. I'll look around. No promises, though. Speedy Oswald, they call me. But I'm quick. Ah, it's you. First outlander to seek a place in the hero's pursuits. Will you ride here too? There's room for you if you want. Yeah, yeah, I'll ride. Might even win. If your arse is as tough as your talk, who knows? Listen up, folks! Race is about to start! Running for the glory, the great mum, or Speedy Oswald. Lonely boy Svan. And Geralt of Rivia. Tis as you said it would be. You won. Glory's yours, as is the prize. Aye? What's it you need? Any chance you know who wore this shawl? Of course. Yona, our herbalist, lives there, in that hut. Oh, she'll be pleased you found it for her. Yeah, real pleased. Found your shawl. Near Lothar's house, by the nithing you put up there. How did you know? Had a hunch. Thanks for confirming it. You know Tjalv has got one foot in the grave. Good. That bastard should never have been born. Me, I was to be Lothar's bride, but he cast me aside for that flounder. Getting his comeuppance now. Him and that whole plowing family. You'd kill a child out of jealousy? Are you serious? It is not jealousy, but dignity that matters here. Ten years we lived side by side. Ten years I cooked for him, washed his breeches, shared me bed. And he abandoned me with nary a word. The whole village laughed. Stupid bent Yona let herself be had. No, I have not been had. Nor have I forgot. Want you to lift the curse. I mean it. Fine, I'll do it. But I've my terms. Lothar's to renounce his son and come back to me. I'll be sure to tell him. But I think we both know what his answer will be. So, you know who placed the knifing? Old friend of yours, Yona. I might have guessed. Jealous bitch! Can't stand to see others happy. So? Will she lift the curse? Yeah, sure. All you gotta do is renounce your family and go back to her. Nay. Never! My wife, my son, I'd strip them of honor. Condemn them to poverty. You've gotta break the spell, Witcher. Let her die! You might deserve to be punished, but not this way. Fine, I'll do it. Thanks be to the gods. Don't bring the gods into it. This is between two human beings. J-O-N-N-A. May it be quick and painless. So? Did it work? It did. 
Your son should recover soon. And Iona will die. Thanks, Witcher. A thousand times over. My son's dearest of all to me. I couldn't abide it if he died. Your reward. Will you eat with us before moving onward? No. Not in the mood. There's truth to that blather by the ice giant. The fiend. wounds. Need to track it down. Eat only the entrails. Fussy. Cross to the other side. Came this way. Toppling trees. Won't get away this time. Tunic. Must be Ove. Avenged those boys. There's that at least. Greetings. Any tidings? Bad ones. Your son's dead. Killed by a fiend. All I could do was avenge him. I told him. Son, nothing good ever came out of Pharaoh. Stay home. Your time will yet come for adventures and glory. Your reward. This gold brought me no luck. May it serve you better. We've offended him, Sven. The woodland spirit seeks revenge. This here is him saying we've strayed from the old paths. Offended him? The monster's killed five already. He doesn't give a rat's arse about paths or tracks or me or you. He's a plowing beast from the plowing forest. Split his ribcage. A strong one, this spirit of yours. That's so. And who might you be? Geralt. I'm a witcher. A killer for hire. What do you seek here? Saw your notice. What notice? This village is home to decent folk only. You won't find any work here. Sure about that? Beast that did this? It's aggressive and incredibly strong. I can help you for a price. I like this man. Play your trade, Witcher. I believe we will agree terms. Who or what is this woodland spirit? Tell you what, it's not any of your concern. It's a common beast. Murders any man who ventures into its territory. 
Exhaustive as descriptions go. What does this spirit look like? Anyone seen it for themselves? No man alive has. Great. Really helpful, all of you. Birds pecked apart his entrails. And here, tooth marks. A large dog. A wolf, maybe. This the way it always kills? Only cowards. True warriors. Men with the hearts of predators. The spirit grants them an honorable death. You said the creature wants revenge. Why? For what? Our forefathers hunted with spear and knife. This pleased the woodland spirit. He let us live in peace. We never knew hunger. He killed back then too. He's always killed. How many lads died trying to become hunters? Now, since our hunters died in the war, the beasts turned even more bloodthirsty. We are ungrate. What others buy with gold, we buy with our lifeblood. We are slaves to fear spread by blind fools like you. These woods are ours. High time we put an end to this beast. I've heard enough. You've got a monster problem, that's clear. Just not sure you want it solved. Oh, we do. Come see me. We'll figure us a fair price for the beast's head. Our little talk while I looked over the corpse? Not nearly enough. Need to look around, figure out what I'm up against. Be not rash, killer. It's not too late to bring back the old ways. I'll decide what to do. But start collecting coin, just in case. No ah. our customs. Ah. Not you, nor that witch, Jennifer. Got a trail to follow. Wonder where it leads. Sharpened its claws, or just marked off its territory. Thin and deep cuts, not unlike a razor. Smashed bones. That takes strength. No point in trying to parry its blows. Aggression. Male. Very old. Damn it. Probably marked one of the villagers. Didn't have many friends, did he? Folk aren't willing to look at this kind of death today. But in the past, I remember. I was just a lad. Lugos Herlip led a raid on our village. Found nothing but silence and fog. I could barely make out my pa and my uncles, lying in wait behind the trees. I remember how they hunted down one warrior after another, and once they surrounded Herlip himself, well, I believe he'd rather have faced the woodland spirit. Your spirit is a very old lesson. He's dangerous, but I should be able to deal with him. Rid us of him, yet he's what made us invincible. Turned us into great warriors. Maybe I wasn't clear. The woodland spirit is a monster. Cut with the sword, he'll bleed and die. Like you, like me. He's much more. Thanks to him, the woods team with game, and our women bear strong babes. The power of the woodland spirit makes us the best hunters in the Isles. True, not every lad who sets out to be a hunter survives the sacred ritual. But aren't witchers made at similar cost? Back by the tree, you said you know another way to stop the lesion. We must return to the old path. Restore the old ways. Roam the woods with knife and spear. Fight on even terms and prove our valor. That would please him. Our ancestors placed the Covenant Stone in the woods, laid sacrifices of prized game on it, and thus made a pact do as they did. Go south along the brook. Submit to the trial by burning a sacrifice of wolves' hearts 
on the sacred spot. Fine. I'll try it your way. But if it fails, I'll have to kill the beast. Wise choice. The spirit will subject you to trial. But you cannot succumb. Succeed in renewing the covenant, and I'll spare no gold in rewarding you. Leshen accepted my offering. I saw the smoke rise and crows dance in the sky. Everything will return to the old ways. You'll see in a few days. I've done my part. Expecting coin, eh? Don't fret. I've got your gold. Take it. You've earned every last bit. You do know young boys will continue to die at the Covenant Stone trying to become hunters. The killing will never end. I've not paid you to lecture me. You've done your job. It's time you left. Well, well, Harold. Paying the Witcher behind our backs to sod off and let the monster live? We finished off the other elders. Just one left. <laughs> Death's but another stage in the cycle. I embrace it. Be gone, Witcher, and you can keep your coin. Think murder will change something? You've done your part. Got your coin. What are you waiting for? No monsters left around here. I won't let you kill him. The Witcher first. Get him! You saved my life, killer. I'd be a corpse, but not for you. Heard Svana let you join the pursuits? But have you truly the courage to run? Mm -hmm. Let's do this. Listen up, good folk. Riding for the glory of Modron Freya today are Geralt of Rivia, Arv Orsman, and Red Ricca. Like Won't let you win, vagrants. Can't. And the winner is Witcher Geralt of Rivia. Such a feat deserves a reward. Here, may it remind you of your glory. Come out. They're dead. Who are they? Bandits. 
Matman Lugos's man. And who are you, my good man? Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Thanks for your aid. If you'd not come by, we'd have been done for. Lugos will wonder what happened to his men. What'll you do? Don't worry about us. Send my boy off to care troll the hasty lake. The Earl's not like to let Lugos off. You best watch your own back. Lugos finds out, and will try to get even. Think I'll manage. Good luck. Wanted to talk. What's new in Skellige? Of late, look seaward and you'll see their son on a sail, staring right back. We've yet to capture any of their crew, but only a fool wouldn't know they're planning something. Sorry, remind me. Where'd Saris go? Speakerog. Got it in her head that she must help Uderic. How? I have the same question. He's a brave man. Some say hot-tempered and hasty, but... If Ceres wanted glory, she'd have done better to sail with Yalmar. As it is, who knows what ideas bat about in her head. Any news of Yalmar? His venture going well? Nah. Tempted after all, eh? If you're itching to join him, it might not be too late. <sighs> Maybe I should visit Undvik. Ask at the new port. Clan Todorok survivors lie around there. They refuse to hunt the giant, but they're willing to talk. You ever play Gwent? Ha! <laughs> Ermion taught me the rules and gave me a deck. Wish to play? Let's play a quick round. You're good. Know what, Wolf? I've this rare card here. Take it. It'll be of more use to you. Thanks. You might consider challenging a man in Kertrolda village. A worthy adversary, though a mere tailor. Just as his name. Greetings. Smooth seas this morn. As if the gods themselves were paying their respects to the great Konung Bran. You a tailor? I am. Only one in the Isles, most like. Any chance you play Gwent? Oh, aye. It's a great passion. Wanna play? I'm ready. Let's do this. Bravo! A grand win. Congratulations! Every man on the continent so bloodless. Glad you're here. We're one short of starting the race. You up for it? Sure am. Grab a horse. People, we've a third. Join in bold Siga and Fish Breath of Gear will be Geralt of Rivia. Is that all you got? Can't you go any faster? Listen, folk. Our winner is Geralt of Rivia. You've bathed yourself in honor, Witcher, and earned a beautiful prize. Well, you've just one pursuit left to run on Hindersfjall. Ride like you did today, and victory's as good as yours. We meet again. So, you change your mind? Want to hunt the Grossbart brothers with me? Easy coin for you. Yeah, we can hunt them together. Run! Let's get going then. I've picked up their trail. They shouldn't be far. Give us all you go! I like you. Went well, I thought. 
Maybe you'd consider working together for a spell. Seems you have a gift for this kind of work. Thanks. Once is enough. So long. To be perfectly honest, I did not think you'd win even one race yet. Here you've gone and won three. Well, you've earned the right to ride in the great race. But do you think you're ready for it? I was born ready. Let's start this. Careful. It's a great honor and a great danger. The time has come for the great race. Riding for glory of Freya will be Geralt of Rivia and last year's champion, Astrid the Vipress. The hero's pursuit is done. Geralt of Rivia has outridden Astrid the Vipress. The White Wolf, our dark horse, has won. Lovely race. The goddess must be pleased, as should you be with your prize. Not bad, gotta admit. Don't know where I'll be a year from now, but I'll try to come back. <laughs>